when you talk about using the areas of your eyes as identification and can open your door and you walk in the internet of things, things are changing rapidly. In fact, it's documented that 40% uh, of all jobs that we do today around the world will be lost uh, in 10 years' time. The world is changing. So if you begin to have a high school system that focuses on home economics, nothing wrong with it, visual arts, nothing wrong with it, general arts, nothing wrong with it, business, good. But you don't look at computer science and programming. You don't look at biomedical sciences. And you don't even begin to think about engineering in high school. Something is wrong with the disconnect between what you are teaching and what they need to do in industry. So when you hear us talking about STEM, we're talking about STEM in all its forms, whether it's biomedical, engineering, whether it's general engineering. We need to move and move fast to ensure that our students are offered similar pathways. And I know we all hear about the fact that we want our university to have 60% STEM. You hear it in the speeches of president. It has been read many, many times to us that all our universities will, be, will enroll 60%. Good. If only 12 to 15% of your high school students are doing science, how does 15% become 60%? When you have also said to yourself that if you did not do science in high school, you would never be an engineer. 